kiss for you. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Welcome to my another video on Android app development. And so, guys, this will be the part two of my video series on app to app audio calling using Firebase and Cinch SDK in Android Studio. All right, guys. So, in our first part of the video, I have shown you the demo of how the app will look like. And now, in this video, we will start working on our project app. So let's get started. So as you guys can see that I already have created the projects. Okay, so one thing uh, which I want to tell you is that in my previous video I was using the Android Studio version 2.3.3, but now I have created the project on Android 3.3.3. Let me show you. All right. So here I have this one so because i was facing uh, some problems in my windows so i have changed this android studio version okay so here we have this main activity and first of all we need to have the login activities for the activity so for that we have we should have the edit text so first of all i will drag okay so here we, i have some problem also with the layout so here let me write center in parent to true then we can have and let's set the width to match parent and let's set the hint to email and let's also make another edit text and let's set it to match parent and wrap content then we can say below edit text and here we can say hint password and we can say input type will be text password and we can set the id to edit text password okay so now we have this email and password and now we will have the button for the login and here we can just print i mean dis display the button and for the button we can also say below id to edit text password and we can say margin top to 10 dp or we can say 20 dp and gravity will be center all right and let's set the text to login and after we have this login screen so we first of all need to go to our main activity and here first of all we will have the some edit text ed email and ed password then we can say ed email equal to edit text find you by id then we can say ed password equal to edit text find you by id r dot id dot edit text password then we create a, a function public void uh, login user and here we can simply get the email and then we get the password and after that we will be integrating the firebase uh, in my next part of the video so in this video first of all we create the cinch app so here go to cinch and here you can see cinch voice api verification and cloud made simple and click on here and there you need to log in or you need to create on free trial to create your own free trial for the cinch and after you click on login in 
and uh, meanwhile let's have some user permission so we can have user permission of internet let me close it my router and now i am successfully logged into my cinch account and after you successfully uh, log in in your cinch account so first of all you need to go to apps and then there you, uh, you will not see any app so you need to you will create a new app and here you will name your app as app caller tutorial and you will need to click on create app all right so now here you will have this app and when you click on that so there you can see the host name the key and the secret key okay so you need to copy all those and store it in your android studio string uh, strings.xml but uh, i will do that later so after you create your app caller tutorial uh, the cinch sdk uh, app inside this this console so after that we will now create the firebase so let's go to firebase console my internet is very slow so all right so here we will create a new project and i will name the project as audio caller and we will click on accept the privacy policy then now our project is will be created now our project is successfully created on the firebase console and now we will need to uh, add this app to our firebase so here we need to have the uh, application package name so you need to go to build.gradle and here we need to have the package name as this and just you need to copy that 
and paste it here then you will click on register app and now we will download this google services dot json file and it's successfully downloaded but we will delete that both of the files and delete and download it again because i already had the previous google json file and now we will add it to our android studio so for that we will click on project view and then here inside this app we will just copy the file and after that we will click on next and we will copy this link and we will paste it here then we will just copy this and we will paste it right there and we will click on next and we will click on skip alright and now we need to click on sync now So guys the Firebase is successfully integrated to our Android Studio and also we have created the Cinch app in the Cinch console. So guys in our next part of the video we will try to use the Firebase out for the login. Okay so guys if you like the video please like it and subscribe. Goodbye.